Piccolo vs. Android 17, in Japanese, The Reborn Piccolo vs. Number 17, is the 173rd chapter of Dragon Ball Z, and the 367th overall chapter of the Dragon Ball manga. Today I will be reviewing Piccolo's fight against 17 by stating facts. Let me know if you guys liked it, enjoy. The cover of the chapter features information about the Red Ribbon Androids. The androids arrive at Kamei House looking for Goku, but find Piccolo who decides to challenge them. They accept the challenge and travel to some nearby islands, to stage their battle. Piccolo, now fused with Kami, is confident in his strength, and decides to fight the androids one at a time, to destroy them so Cell cannot be complete. Android 16 notes that there has been a strange change in Piccolo. Piccolo attacks Android 17 first and the battle begins. As the battle rages the two fight on a near equal level. Android 17 is confused as he notes that Piccolo is now stronger than Goku, according to his database. Nonetheless, Android 17 concludes that Piccolo will eventually get tired and lose. Impatient, Android 18 says she can beat Piccolo and offers to tag in, but Android 17 declines the offer. To Piccolo's horror, Cell shows up to join the battle. The androids do not know who Cell is and tell him to leave. Cell charges up scaring Piccolo, since 17 and 18 cannot sense power levels. Piccolo wonders how many thousands of people he had to absorb to gain that much key since their last encounter. Cell starts his attack on Android 17 to absorb him. Piccolo tries to help him, but both are overpowered by Cell. Piccolo is blasted by Cell and thought to be killed. Cell then starts attacking Android 17 again, of whom tries to fight to no avail. Android 18 questions why 17 is losing since he is supposed to be the ultimate android. To her surprise, Android 16 reveals that he is in fact the superior model, and stronger than Cell in his imperfect form. Android 16 then goes to rescue Android 17 and battle Cell. As far as I can remember this fight gets mentioned in Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2, by far the best story mode Dragon Ball game. Well that was it guys, I hope you enjoyed. Feel free to suggest new video ideas. Take care.